Okay, this is my clean, unaffected uh, sound. <laughs> into a, in the normal channel, a Vox AC15, I'm using a, uh, a John Lennon uh, Epiphone, it's got Gibson P90 um, pickups in, it's a great sounding guitar, I'm using the bridge pickup at the moment, and this is with the colour box. I've got a smidgen of um, reverb on. It's, it's um, barely there, but it's uh, enough to give it a little bit of um, a bit of depth. So I mean, I've only had a quick play with this, and I've, I've set it up to how I think it sounds good for what I want to do with it. Um, it cleans up quite well. I've got all the guitar um, settings full on ten at the moment, so it reacts very well to pick control as well. For example. It's got a lovely bite, how I set it up at the moment. I know there's so much more you can do with it, fuzz and overdriven and distortion, but I've literally got it out of the box, twiddled a few of the dials around to find a setting that I like at the moment, and, and that's what I've got. Um, for example, if I put it on the uh, neck pickup, so it's quite a... <laughs> It's almost got that um, knackered Fender amp, soup pro -y sort of sound to it, uh, which I like. Uh, for example, um, Guitar's over. <clears throat> I've now got the uh, my Les Paul 1969 uh, Deluxe. It's got mini humbuckers in this one. It's all original. Um, it's got a nice bite to it. Uh, this is my uh, clean straight into the AC uh, 15. <laughs> tiny bit of reverb on still. Uh, this is on my neck pickup and this is I've changed ever so slightly uh, from the last uh, clip on the uh, with the Epiphone John Lennon a few of the controls but not drastically changed that much and this is the sound now. <laughs> It's a great
great biting sound the colour box gives. <clears throat> I'm not sure how, how it will come across on, um, on YouTube, but um, it's very clear, um, it's very driven, very distinctive tone. Um, if we try it on, for example, keeping all, everything the same. There you go. I'm mostly going to be using this pedal as a guitar pedal. I don't think I'll take, be taking it into desks and boards and all that sort of thing. Um, it does respond very well to, to pick attack and the way you play. Um, keeping all the guitar controls the same, but just altering the, the amount of attack I'm giving the pick. You can get some really heavy to light to very full uh, tones from it, for, uh, for example.